This is my movie about Mimi Ito. She is a cultural anthropologist and expert in the fields of digital media and learning, focusing on children and youth changing relationships to media and communications. Ito emphasizes the need to put aside prejudice against new media in order to harness their potential as learning tools. She says, I think there's a more general perception in culture around new media that is inherently a space that is hostile to learning. And that's the perception that I think we really need to work against. We know that the learning outside of school matters tremendously for the learning in school. The question is, how can we be more active about linking those two together? Diversity is the top finding in the range of what kids are doing online and what they are learning. Some kids are engaged in web tools having to do with media production editing, which enhances technical media literacy. I think for teachers uh, and schools and classroom learning, there's still an incredibly important role to play, which is about giving kids access uh, across the board to a baseline set of standards, literacies, expectations about what they need to participate uh, in contemporary society, to be reflective, um, and to also take opportunity of the fact that you really have kids and adults in a shared space that's safe, that's sanctioned, uh, that gives kids an opportunity to reflect on things in their everyday life that's not just about them being immersed in it all the time. So I think that there are incredibly important functions for schools. What we're saying by valuing informal learning is not that we should abandon formal learning, but that we should get those working together in a much more coordinated way. Mimi Ito is a professor at Humanities Research Institute at the University of California. Right now, she is focusing on how to support socially connected learning experiences for young people and is part of the Connected Learning Alliance.